Hey everybody, Greg with the Fix My Bleak channel. Thanks so much for joining me today. I'm going to cover some common issues people have with dual displays on their Windows computer and you can fix it all using the built-in software. First off, how to swap your windows around, how to set your primary screen or monitor, and also how to change that resolution. So let's jump right in and let's get to it. Alright, so most commonly we'll get calls on uh, somebody's got dual monitors but their screens are backwards or their mouse isn't transitioning from the left screen to the right screen. So they'll move the mouse and it'll come over and it'll hit the side of the monitor, but it won't go over to the, from the left monitor to the right monitor. See how that's doing that? But yet they'll drag it over here and then it magically appears over on this monitor. So to fix this issue, to get it to transition, you want to move your mouse over in an open area and you want to right click you'll get a pop-up window, go down to display settings, click display settings, the screen opens up and you'll have your two monitors come up under display settings. So you want to click your left monitor, drag it over the top of the right monitor in the little display window, drag it all the way to the right and then let go of it, have them side by side, and then click the apply button after you've drug it over there. You want to minimize your window. Take your cursor now and see if it'll transition over from the left to the right. Look at that. See how it's transitioning now? So you fix that first problem. So that's how you fix the, the mouse when it's hitting that side. Now it'll transition back and forth. And again, to drag those windows over each other, you go to display settings and you just move these windows over like that and then hit apply to rearrange your monitors. So the next issue, if you uh, want to set a primary monitor, so right now the right one's the primary and the left one is your secondary, but most people want the left monitor as their primary monitor. So again, you move your cursor out in an open area and you right click Get the little pop-up window, you go to display settings, click on that. You hit the identify button and you get these little pop-ups. So identify, you want monitor one to be your primary. So you click monitor one, go down. You'll have an option here to make this my main display. So click one go down, click the box, make this my main display. All your icons just pull themselves over to your primary monitor. Now monitor one is your main display. Mouse is still transitioning back and forth and you're all set. That issue has been resolved. Your primary monitor has been set. To change your resolution, you right click, add in the open area here, Go to display settings on the little pop-up window. You'll scroll down. You'll notice right here you've got display resolution. Click that drop down. Normally you want to go with the recommended resolution. Mine is set to 1920 by 1080. So I'm going to leave it on that. If you go to one of these other resolutions, like 800 by 600, that's going to blow everything up so it's gigantic. You probably don't want that. So I'd just go with the recommended. You'll notice you do have scale and layout. Normally you want to use the 100% or the recommended. That's just going to work better on your Windows apps and all your standard applications. Um, if you go with a larger scale or layout, it's just going to make everything bigger. Minimize your windows, make sure everything looks good, make sure the mouse is still transitioning, and you should be all set. So a quick little bonus for you. A lot of people will have two monitors set up. Two monitors, everything's plugged into your computer, monitor's powered on, but nothing comes on. And so we get calls on this all the time. So what's the problem? How do you fix that? So you, again, right click out in an open area, go to display settings. Now it doesn't matter which monitor came on, if it's the right one that came on or the left one came on, only one of them comes on. So yeah, right click, display settings. 
you'll notice that one display is lit up, the other is kind of grayed out. No worries. You go down here to multiple displays. It says show only on one. You click the drop down. You click extend these displays. It blacks out for a second, freaks out. Then you want to hit keep changes because the other display just lit up. So keep changes. Minimize your window. And then repeat steps one through three. Make sure that mouse is going to transition over. Cursor's going over. Yep. Make sure your left display, if that's the one you want as your primary, is set to your primary. Make sure your resolution looks good. And then you are all set to work with dual monitors. So just so you know, this technique works on laptops and regular workstations. So whether you have a laptop that you're docking in and you have two monitors and one's not coming on or you need to swap the screens around or whether you have a workstation and you need to swap the screens around or change resolution or set a primary monitor. Let's work on both. All right, so that's all I have on the display settings video. Be sure and leave a comment. Also like and subscribe, it really helps out my channel. Check out these other videos I've got going on and I'll catch you guys later.